Hello again, Mike Fratelloni here doing our blog and we're going to talk a little bit about fertilizer. We're right in the middle of summer. It's about July 8th today when I'm filming this and a lot of people are coming in saying, what do I put down right now? Historically, you'd put down the third step of the four step program from Scott's and that's always your insect control step. Here's the Lawn Pro label. This is Scott's Lawn Pro. It's lawn insect control plus fertilizer. In fact, it has 26% nitrogen so you're going to get a spike greening of your yard, yard right after you put that that down. So let me say that again. It's 26% nitrogen, but it's spike nitrogen, not slow release nitrogen. So you put this bag down today, tomorrow your grass is going to be greener. The next one, I'll lift it up to you, is called Turf Builder with Summer Guard. It doesn't scream lawn insect control because people don't really think lawn insect control is very important. That's what consumers think. But if you want great turf, you know that this, this third step, the lawn insect control step, is very, very important. So again, this one has 26% nitrogen plus the same killing chemical, same insect killing chemical as, as the Lawn Pro line, but this is a slow bleed nitrogen. So you put this down today and slowly over the next few months, you're going to get a, a feeding of nitrogen. So your grass is going to stay greener much longer than the Lawn Pro. Lawn Pro makes it instantaneously green. This one makes it green for months. Okay, so in your garage, you have a half a bag of winterizer, you have a half a bag of crabgrass control, you have a half a bag of something else. Well, you can use all of those things really any time during the year. So, you know, people say, well, what do I do with crabgrass? Crabgrass is already up. You can still put crabgrass preventer town. It's not going to do anything against the crabgrass, but the fertilizer is still in the bag, so it will be like feeding your yard. So it won't do anything again to prevent the crabgrass from germinating. It's already too late this time of year, but you can go ahead and put down the feed. Or if you have a fall fertilizer that's just a feeding, you can put that down too. You can even mix them in the same drum. What you just want to make sure is that you don't overfeed. If you would put this one down and a week later put another one down and a week later put another one down, you're putting too much nitrogen down in your yard and you're asking your, your yard to do too much. So uh, we have it here right now. It's uh, the right price and the right product and you need to put it down. With all this rain, it is a very good idea to come and get this insect control because it will make your grass look and, and truly be much, much better for next year. Thanks.